Hi! Today we're going to be taking a look at CoinMarketCap's new portfolio feature. Portfolios let you track your crypto purchases by viewing their performance, gains, and losses over time. We'll be covering some basics here, so let's start. To access CoinMarketCap's portfolio feature, we'll need to log in first. If you have an account with us, simply enter your email address and password. If you don't have a CoinMarketCap account, this would be a great time to do it. Anyway, let's log in. Now that we're logged in, we'll click on the Portfolio category in our top menu. From this page, let's go ahead and click into the Create Your Portfolio button. Now we have a list of tokens that we can add to our portfolio. We can find our preferred token by scrolling down or by searching in the field here. CoinMarketCap is tracking almost 10,000 cryptocurrencies, so if you've purchased nearly any asset out there, you should be able to find it. So let's go ahead and create a portfolio with the most obscure cryptocurrency that you've probably never heard of, Bitcoin. I'll click on Bitcoin, which takes us to our next screen. Now keep in mind our portfolio does not actually buy cryptocurrencies. We're just tracking purchases and sales from elsewhere. Okay, so let's say that we bought 0.1 Bitcoin on April 14th, 2021. at 2 p.m. We can also add any fees and possibly a comment in the notes if we need. Once this is filled out, CoinMarketCap will automatically adjust the value based on the quantity and time that our crypto is purchased. So let's add the transaction. And now we can see that our asset is in the main page of our portfolio. The view displays information like the current price, our current holdings, and the overall profit or loss for this asset based on the latest information from CoinMarketCap. If you want to add more tokens, we can just click the Add Transaction button and create another asset. We hope this walkthrough was useful. If you want to learn more about CoinMarketCap's portfolio feature, please let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and uh, we hope to see you in the next video.